Hello everyone and welcome to Start to Finish for Sea of Stars. My name is Matt Boyer, this is the second attempt at episode 18. The only thing you missed when my feed mysteriously died for a moment is that uh, it was nighttime, and then I spun this around and this became a day and then now I can interact with it. Now, I, I alt f 4 out of what happened after this, so I don't know what happens. Here we go. I hope that it stays good. Okay. Whoa. Well, you're cool. Wee woo woo wahoo. Okay. Strolling minstrel. When the moon shines bright on autumn leaves. Comes forth the abomination of roots and leaves. You're rhyming leaves with leaves. Alright, Pitbull. Not that Pitbull can do that. Okay, I'm sorry. I was thinking about Pitbull. What? What did you say at any point? Okay, yeah, here we go. Something about roots and leaves. Put all the leaves in. Now, were you like moon or sun? Moon. Check out that cool moon. What do you think about this? You're gonna fight me now, because I said it was an abomination. Hello! Great! Yeah, all right. All right. I suppose I actually could have prevented this. Ain't no. no. <laughs> all right. Okay. Ooh, zero damage. Why zero? But you took damage from him, right? Oh, make it. You were where you were naked? Okay. So we put the pain in. Yeah, okay, that was pretty good. Alright, so you don't take any damage from that. So, what happens if I hit you with a sunball? Does it burn us off? No. I think most of us need to hold on until you uh, throw your clothes at us. A skin chucker. Let's interrupt this. I'm enjoying the music. Alright, clear leaves. You are in so much trouble, my friend. You are in so much trouble. Do I need to save up for the Soonerang? Which I actually almost am too. But what if I did a Moonerang and followed it with a Soonerang? That sounds pretty good. I think your clothes are going to come back this turn. That's unfortunate. No, don't bring it back! Ow. Brought it back! Alright, now we'll do a heal. Nourish! 
still an apple. Ow. So, yeah, just build up, really. You are so dead. I don't have any timing, but you are so dead. Get but so upset. I'm taking no bones. Alright, switch. Combo. Soon rang. so cool my bardic friend where did you go what what are you doing here I don't think you're the slam dancing bard that would be the spooniest Ooh. 20 years ago, in the village of Moon Cradle. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at them. Oh, look at him! Pet mistress. Oh, oh, I didn't know of a head mistress. Okay, big group. The twins, which <laughs> I I, li I like the narrowing your eyes. I'm doing that right now. No one can see me. I don't play with a webcam. Pumpkins. This is what children do. They get on top of something and sit. I like it. Moyara. I don't remember if we've come across that name. We might have. So, ooh, hmm. oh, she's one of the triplets. Thank you, everyone in the chat. I really appreciate that. So, so, what happened to the twins? So then, what's supposed to happen to Bergaves and Arlena when they do it? 
Actually, was everyone supposed to go there and die? Is that how this works? Is it like a... Is it a... Is it a final summoning? I think he's asleep. There you go. Somnambulists. Oh, we're still in the flashback. Whoa, all caps. Did say they, but I think she. Oh boy, howdy! They did say that a lot of people it was it was a very costly ceiling. I mean, it can't be one of the tiny children. He's a great teacher. You can tell. Okay. Ooh. Nice. Give him hell. Like, I get it. He watched all of his friends and people that he believed in die in front of him, which is which is awful. But then he's taking it out on them. What are they supposed to do about that? They're kids. Oh, they always wanted to leave. Hi, pigeons. I hear you outside. Oh! Oh, they tried! Oh, they had a the, my little loading thing is different, too. Twenty! Running away didn't really work that well. It's been 35 minutes. <laughs> but they're still going to try and find their way out. Ooh, a festival. We didn't get to go to any festivals. Stop. Flip was that? Oh, the Great Eagle. Okay, thank you. Do, 
Okay, just chuck the baby. Red text because it's with the red is the color of the enemy. That's what you do when you see red moving on your mini map, you know that your opponent has attacked your workers. Yeah, okay, we've been doing this for a while. Okay, so they've been pitching B and E for a while. Found the weakness. So, young Arlena, she's got the the four the third eye thing, which just makes me think of the Garlean third eye from Final Fantasy XIV, which obviously that's not what this is. Um, it's gotten bigger with her. I wonder how significant it is, because they have three eyes. That's why that's jumping out at me. I'm the fruit for two. Oh, we don't get to know the terms. Okay, multiple worlds. Ugh. Oh, that's unpleasant to think about. I don't like... I don't like memory stuff. I love it as a narrative device. But... Me, personally... Ah, creeps me out. It's a great narrative device. I mean, we know you say yes. We know you say yes. Multiple worlds. Well, at the oh right, the other wife's memories. That's the one we took out just a little bit ago. Wait, have we taken it out? We're protected from memory, though. So I think it's where we're headed. No, we took something out. I don't remember if it did memory. I think it did. In my defense, we bought a house last week. My brain is, is applesauce. Yeah, I do. 
that last part's not true. I wish I could hear her tone here. Because I hear it as, we will add a condition that they can go and live with you. Wouldn't you like that? They're definitely going to refuse. We're definitely going to refuse. Oh, don't overstate your importance. You're being betrayed! And this is the part from the opening, because that's, yeah, 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 yeah. No. Okay, I understand, but I don't accept. I see how you got to where you are now, but I disagree with literally everything about you. But I'm going to go to Lake Turquoise and not engage. Fluorescent piranha. It's a fish. That's just a crab. Come here, crab. Whoa. Crab. You're doing good, crab. Come on, crab. Come on, crab. Crab. That is... Don't eat that. I don't care what it says. Oh, you! Oh, you're another crab. I mean, I'll still take you. Good, good place. Eh, eh, eh. Great! Weird fish. All the way! Dang it. Nope. I don't want another one. Starfish time. Now, is it gonna have a cool name? Whoa. It's a rocket booster on that one. Look at that! A ninja starfish. Great. Got it, let's go. Thanks, Rashawn. Glad you agreed with me doing this instead of saving the world. Song Shrew Marsh. I should probably hang on. Back outside. Amp. Rest, head right back in. Clockwork. I didn't know it was going to be clockwork! Clockwork stuff. I do, just very much. I had, for a little while, from an antique store back in Kansas City, I had a fan that was copper in color, definitely not in construction, that looked like an owl. I think Megan got it for me. And it made me think of Lechku and Nechku from Okami, which is like my favorite boss in Okami and absolutely not hers. 
one another. I love clockwork stuff. The mushrooms are smiling. Hi, mushroom. Are you happy all the time? The mushroom is always happy. Happy shrooms. Y'all playing tennis? <laughs> Why are you doing that with your head? That's weird. Okay, that didn't do everything. Oh, that was that was funny. I enjoyed that. What are you gonna do? Oh, oh, you, that was that was misdirection. You're lying. Tied to a particular part of the music? Yeah, I'm gonna stand here and stare at these mushrooms. I'm ready. Pay attention. Ah, it's a little quiet in the background! Oh my god! I want to live here! I love that so much! Look at them! Oh, that one needs to get their mouth out of the water. Well, can't get that one. What I could do is weaken it and also press it or everything. Look at them! 
I'm upset with how cute this is. Oh, a little, little drum fill there. I should probably heal. I mean, actually, I should probably stop the Switch! Donga donga. I'm ready. I'm just not ready. Turns out. Oh, no, not at him again. Oh, wait. <laughs> All right, no, that was just me. That was just me being wrong. Crescent arc. On the right one. There we go. Double whammy. Okay, don't jump in this one. Doesn't let you jump in this one. I appreciate that. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. This is where I'm supposed to go? This looks like where I'm supposed to go. What else is over here? Oh. Nothing. That's it. I'm supposed to go this way because it's the only thing I can. Music is so fun. Check. Ah, everyone's fine. Is that what they sound like? They give us one talking? Are they gonna have that little adorable squeak noise? Can the mushrooms join the party? I'll trade Garl for them. We won't finish the game because he turns all the turns everything on. Oh, oh, run away. We're about to get ambushed. Or maybe everyone's just gonna be really friendly. You can't get away from me. Maybe I shouldn't let you. Motor shoot. Cook or surprise them. Oh, if I hit that, I might have killed him. He's, he's still alive. Still alive. Oh, that's just unfortunate for us. Okay, I'm gonna swap you back out. There we go. There, got rid of the only one that I could. This doesn't do that much damage. Which is good, because I, I don't know how to block it, apparently. Oh, I didn't even know where you were going! Oh, it froze again! Hang on. Hang on. What is up with the stream today? You're terrible. Hang on, it's coming back. It's coming back. 
It's coming back. Yeah, Twitch forgot how to accept streams. But it's back now. That's why I have to have the chat up. Because who knows what's gonna go bad for me. I need to kill all these people. Uh, how am I gonna do that? Oh, no one's together enough for this to hit them. This will hit them. There we go. I didn't do much, but it did work. Oh, this is actually fine, because... I'll get MP back. There we go. not take me far enough. We'll get there. Oh, okay. This is like pirate music. That's what's making me think of. Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yoink. Yeah. Look at that rock in that water out there. It's so good. Don't jump down a ramp onto some stairs. You're gonna hurt yourself. Weaken it. We'll let them do their attacks. Oh, he's dead. Alright, so maybe that was a bad idea. Uh, but it is what I did, so... A bit of a bummer. Do it long. We're gonna be fine. Ow. Kill everything. 
power of cooking. Alright, that, that got one of them. He's back, everybody! Oh, no. Good. You're dead. And you are not dead. At least weaken you. We'll do a heal in a second. With our combo. Combo, mending light. I haven't gotten Rashawn's regular attack to steadily do AoE, I don't think. I feel like I'm not understanding it. I thought he had only happened when he killed someone. That was... Timing's a little... Do I have to hit the button twice for him? I feel like maybe I do. Do that. There we go. Then do this. There we are. That's fun. Oh, whoa! Oh, amazing. Time. Power to rain. Did not do anything to you. All right, you took a lot of damage from the moon. tips in chat. Signed version of Rashawn's abilities when the second bottle and the first bottle collide at the same time. Ah, oh, okay. Let's try that. Switch. Oh, you're gonna die. Well, it's fine. So I have to press the button to make the second one happen. I did not do. Okay. Understood. I do have to press the button twice. I can do that. I just didn't want to. Quite did. Good. Closed you out. Combo. No, not it's not gonna do it. You. And finish the job. 
job. That's another Moonerang right there. Oh, we've almost leveled. I want to level so badly. Leveling up is so much fun. Very satisfying. Okay, and then this went down, so I can grapple over to here. Grapnel. I apologize. Ooh. Can I get there now? No. Ah, oh, no. It will be through here. Uh, I can't help but notice the music just went away. It's a cozy little cottage. Speak, friend, and enter. Knock, punk, and leave. No. And they never have. I've played Baldur's Gate 3. No, you're not. 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 Okay, you kind of were supposed to be neutral. reputation precedes us. Of course you don't. Yeah, me too. Okay, can I have a key to that other gate then? What? He could be anybody. He's a simple alchemist. your life lets you save, if that helps. Don't eat the books. <laughs> yeah, shouldn't it just be called spirit? You have to you take a word. Nowadays, if you're naming something, you take a word and you eliminate a really important letter from it, or you change it out for like a Y. How are you going to be able to make your IPO with a long name like that? I don't know what that word is. Volume 2. 
the first one was full of profanity. cracking that code. It's gotta be something cooler than lead into gold, right? Living glass. That is way cooler. Play wheels. Nobody knows. I don't think I have anything new from you, do I? Oh, I do. I do. The two alchemists. Countless millennia ago. Two powerful alchemists named Rashan and Aferol set out to create the elixir of life and succeeded. As all things in alchemy come at a price, the gift of immortality caused their bodies to decay, leading them to conceal their hideousness under colorful robes. Reveling at first in the bright side of their immortal coil, they spent centuries nurturing the world and creating wonders to inspire its mortals. Over time, however, Aetheril grew increasingly jealous of the ephem ephemeral ephemerality. ephemerality he would never taste again. Thus began his wicked journey into the forbidden schools of alchemy. A journey which would see every last bit of good in his heart dissipate as he experimented with soul, bone, flesh, and blood alike. As fate would have it, Aetheril fully embraced evil and emerged as the Fleshmancer, a vengeful immortal plaguing the world with his monstrous creations. Rishan tried intervening as best he could, but all that ensued was unspeakable chaos and collateral damage as the two former friends fought with godlike powers. After much struggle, Rishan discovered the Flesh Minion's only weaknesses to be solar and lunar magic, a power bestowed upon those born during a solstice. He began training these children to become solstice warriors, singularly tasked with culling the numbers of the Flesh Mancer's creation. But April's knowledge was also growing. Eventually, he became capable of creating oddities of unlimited potential known as Dwellers. 
they would be impervious to all forms of magic, except during a total eclipse when solstice warriors would have a very short window to attempt taking them down. And dwellers, it turned out, were creatures in development feeding on local life. Left to their own devices for too long, they would evolve into world eaters, spelling doom for all. Armed with knowledge and power, solstice warriors would patrol the world, tracking dwellers to determine which should be taken down during the next eclipse. If they remained vigilant, there would never be a world eater. But Rashan knew such a stalemate would only cause Aetheril to devise something even worse. In a desperate attempt to get ahead, Rashan boldly performed transmutation alchemy on the very space-time continuum itself. After successfully splitting reality into countless timelines and parallel worlds, he shelved his alchemy vial and took up the mantle of Archivist. On an endless journey across all realities, he would catalog every possible outcome in search of a resolution to the throes of the Fleshmancer. Meanwhile, April rejoiced at the infinite number of opportunities for destruction that had just opened up to him. To find some measure of peace amidst their immortal conflict, the two alchemists made a pact to let the fate of each timeline play out on its own. And so the game of cat and mouse began, played by dwellers and solstice warriors on one level, and by Rishan and Aetheril on another. Across a myriad of timelines and over innumerous centuries, some worlds would never be visited by Aetheril, while others would be cursed by his mark. Once marked, it was only a matter of time until the world met its finality, often following centuries of struggle. Each would either be destroyed by a world eater, or permanently saved by the ascension of a pair of solstice warriors into guardian gods. As to when Rashan plans on recomposing the timelines, or whether he even knows how, remains to be seen. The end. Spooky! There's that, that is going to be important, and that's going to be weird. Pretty sure we are full up on food. No, we are not. Ooh. I'll get a parfait. But that will revive some of the power of parfait. Wait, no, not yet. Rest, 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 rest. Alright, well the archive of this is going to be a little more chaotic on account of we had the... Is this the only time I saved the entire day? Oh my god. Alright. I guess when would I have any otherwise? Anyway, have a wonderful rest of your day everyone. I will see you all next time. Bye!